Well, we invite you to wake up with News 3 tomorrow for the latest on road conditions and any weather, any closures or delays, we'll have the very latest. Well, more on tonight's top story, David Douglas, the very latest on a police manhunt. He's live on the scene on Madison's west side with a, more on this breaking story. David? An absolutely horrific tragedy, Eric, here in the weeks before Christmas. Four people shot and killed tonight. We want to take a look at the person of interest in this case. His name is Tyrone M. Adair. If you've seen him, if you know who he is, if you know where he is, you were urged to call police. He's described as a black male born in 1971. He's about 5'10", 175 pounds. We want to give you a description of the vehicle he's believed to be in, or at least could be in. It's a silver GMC Acadia. Has the license plate 342. EBL here on Park Edge Drive in Madison tonight. We can tell you that two people were shot, a mother and a young daughter, inside a car parked inside their garage. When we take a look at the scene now, we see there is still a car in the garage. Whether or not that is the car, we cannot tell you. But what we can tell you, in a situation like this, that rises to this level, police are going to be very careful with all the evidence. They will be out here all night because when this case finally gets to court, they don't want there to be any question about any of the evidence. They want it to be all perfectly preserved. And of course, in the snow, that can be challenging. So at this point, Tyrone Emadair is the person police are looking for. He is responsible, they believe, for it not just this shooting incident here in Madison, but possibly another in Dane County. We know four people have been shot and killed, two mothers and two daughters. Tyrone Amadeir is the person they are looking for tonight, a person of interest in this case. We, David, we don't have the other location just yet, though. We, we just know it's, they're saying it's somewhere in Dane County, correct? Somewhere in Dane County, Eric. And we know it's not in Madison because we know Madison police would be involved in that. The very latest on this case tomorrow morning on News 3 This Morning and all the time at Channel3000.com. All right, David Douglas reporting once again live from Madison's West Side. We'll have all the latest on News 3 This Morning. Have a good night.